Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to get Spoutcraft. Spoutcraft is a Minecraft that's been updated to impro improve uh, frames per second and other information things. Um, to get Spoutcraft, just search Spoutcraft on uh, Google. Um, should be the first one. Um, just find one until you get a dot .jar. Um, pretty sure... Um, I'll come back once I found the download. Wait a sec. Okay, I'm back. Um, basically, Spoutcraft is the second one. Is the one you want. Um, you can download the automatic updater for it, so you don't have to keep redownloading. And uh, get the .exe. Pretty sure that should be it. Uh, just let it run. And something called Spoutcraft Launcher will open. Spoutcraft Launcher is basically a, uh, it's a, I mean, a Spoutcraft will improve frames per second and stuff. Um, it's really helpful for in the game, and, uh, it allows for user and pass. Don't worry, it's all safe and encrypted. Um, log in, it'll download everything. Um, see, it just runs up like normal Minecraft. But here, let me move this around. Um, basically, um, at the bar bottom, there's a blue text. Um, there's texture pack. Every, uh, basically everything a regular Minecraft has. But there's also an about. There's I don't know why my cursor is like that, but um, multiplayer is a better. Uh, GUI setup, so if I want to build, like, um, uh, I'll just, and then you can, like, after you put in your IP, you can put in, like, spawn craft, and it'll save, so you can join anytime, um, you can delete, it's really helpful, um, but unfortunately, you'll have to redo all your world, so I'm not going to be using this for my videos. I'm just going to be showing you basically what it can be. Um, I will still be using Minecraft.exe um, because I don't really like Spellcraft, but no one's really heard of it. Well, some people have, but just it's not really that heard of. Um, this is basically it's the same as Minecraft, except it will overall improve your gameplay. If I press F3, it'll display my frames per second and other useful information. I'm getting about 17 frames per second on FAR with smooth, smooth lighting enabled, along with bobbing and um, fancy render settings. Um, the FPS doesn't seem that good now, but... I'll show you uh, what the options. Um, the options basically just look the same. Um, when you click on video settings, a, a huge array of things. You can just test out what you like. Um, I don't really know what happened. Uh, I'll go back when I reopen it. That was awkward. Okay, that was kind of awkward. Oh, it shows my guy's no face. Okay. Um, I know, uh, as I said, it's relatively new, so it will bug out a little bit. Um, uh, right now, there seems just to be little lag. We're on fast mode, and we're getting 30, 20 FPS. And that is insane, because usually I only get about 15 when I have this. But now I'm getting like 22. Um, the sounds are up high, so I'm not gonna do much. Just it helps out the game a lot. I'm gonna be showing you um, really quickly. Oh, this is a weird world. But I'm gonna be showing you really quickly um, some stuff. Of the options. Uh, so many options you can test out. Um, it gives you a bunch of information, as you can see. But you can just read it really quick. Like you can uh, change performance like usual, but there's also an option called VSync. 
Um, I just, I'm going to go into my settings I like. Um, I don't really know most of these, but I guess it already will load chunks. So let's see what happens here. I think the chunks are already loaded. Uh, not too sure on that one, but okay there's that nice of mobs but um sorry this video is not that good of quality I'm just quickly making it because I just want it to go get out um because no one really uses spout craft and I think it's pretty cool um there's also an option um like on townie that it's really user friendly with townie and stuff um it doesn't cost anything. As I said, just search Spoutcraft and the right one will come up. Uh, comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos, tutorials, shoutouts, and everything else. Uh, yeah, see ya.